You ever heard of Dr. Paul Severn? Guy behind these public health initiatives, clean needles, condoms, and all that bullshit? The guy who's all over the TV, endorsing your pal Reverend Goodman for mayor? I got Goodman that endorsement, actually. A few weeks back, Severn and I met up at an auction and found ourselves in a bidding war over a state-of-the-art seaplane. And being the gentleman I am, I let him win. So he got drunk off the thrill of the win, and you got to ask for his endorsement at just the right time. On the money. Problem is, I really wanted that plane. So you're gonna get it for me. You want me to steal a plane? That's not exactly something I can just slip into my coat pocket. Slip it up your ass for all I care. Just go to the marina and do the job. Now! Respectable man in Nevada doesn't need a seaplane. Damn it. Sorry, guys. Nothing stands between a man and his plane. Now for the fun part.
What did I tell you? She's a beauty, right? Don't you think your friend is gonna be pissed? He's had his chance to enjoy it. You know, I thought you'd put up a little more resistance when I tapped you. Part of me thinks you actually like a little blood on your hands. You don't know anything about me, Frank. Don't waste your time with the innocent Boston altar boy act. I didn't pick you up out of nowhere without looking into you first. You know there's no such thing as a clean slate, right? See you around, Jason. Yeah? Hey, fly guy. Hey, Ronnie. Nice job with the plane. How do you know about that? I told you, I know people. Listen, you ever want to show off your piloting skills, go see my friend the Aviatrix. True story? I have no idea what her real name is. Like, I actually address her like that. Anyway, go see her sometime. I might do that. Later, Tater.